Yep, this qualifies as a snowstorm. Trick to plowing snow is don't ram the vehicle. Use your head, it's kind of like mowing along. Inside, okay. got the heater, got your radio, you got it made. But you also have to use your head. You do not want to get stuck, unless you like to shovel. We poked a hole through the driveway, and you've also got to think about cars going by, and there goes one right there. So that bringing the snow at the end of the driveway out into the roadway, getting hit isn't too smart. So we're going to have to wait and see if anybody's coming up the road or down the road and get out of the vehicle to be safe. There was a bread truck that just went by. See, some people have to get to work. Ambulance workers, firefighters. It's not a day off from school to watch reruns of I Dream of Genie. The problem is visibility. There isn't any. But we're glad we're on the ground and not up in the air, I guess. The coast is clear. Had one ramming speed. You can see the hood where it got hit. And here comes the vehicle, a brave soul. But the roads, the main U.S. highways are well maintained. We've got the equipment. We don't have a million cars on the road to deal with. And we know how to plow snow. We like snow. We play in it. We know how to manage it. As are a few in the far northern Augusta County. Here is a list of the schools that are closed due to the storm. Caribou Schools, Connor, School Union 122, Van Buren Area Schools, Fort Kent Area Schools are all closed today. This can happen too, where you get stuck in just enough snow. That's why they invented these little guys. My New Year's resolutions, get more exercise. Yeah, that's cool. And the town of Holton is all dug out. Here's coming into town on US Route 1. Some banks you have to watch out for. They'll snow blow the town, usually in the middle of the night when there's no cars around. There'll be a big island of snow in the front and the center of Market Square. Yep, here it is. And the cars have to kind of park lengthways rather than at an angle. The kids are happy, school's out, and not a lot of activity for the day after New Year's. This is Market Square we just went through. Now we're going up through Main Street. Give you an idea of what it looks like after a snowstorm, and this qualified as a snowstorm. Here's the Lodge Belt. Here's our Cary Library. And the Chamber of Commerce that didn't quite get totally painted this year. Grand older houses. It's pretty. This is the Episcopal Church. Sorry for the bumps, but there's a lot of snow on the road. And hopefully the rec center is open so the kids can get some exercise. Although shoveling snow is good physical therapy. Louis Blanchet. Digging out with a snow blower. Then you've got your domestic models. This was the Odd Fellows building. Holton Police and Fire.
Lawrence is heading up Elm Street. Bolton is blessed with lots of Victorian homes. And they're pretty in all four seasons. That's the town office in Holton. When they announced school was going to be canceled, the town office also announced that it might be 10 o'clock before they got open. And sure enough, they're open. The army of snowplows roaming, looking for snowbanks. and driveways to plow. This is University College in Holton, part of the University main system. Artwork. Happy New Year from Holton, Maine.